The U.S. Department of Energy uh, tells us that homes built before 1980 uh, are tremendously under-insulated. And in fact, insulation wasn't required uh, until the 1970s. So many homes uh, built prior to that uh, have little or no insulation whatsoever. The house, uh, especially the kitchen, and that's where the brick is on this house, I noticed that the kitchen was exceptionally cold to the rest of the house like five to eight degrees difference um, throughout the day and then into the night. And even if I opened the kitchen cabinets, they felt like they were refrigerated. They were just so cold. The plates, dishes, the uh, glasses, everything I pulled out always was cold. My house is very drafty. Uh, it was built in 1945. It's an old lake home out here. And I always knew it had breezes. Very difficult to heat. I have a 40 by 30 great room with 20 foot ceiling and trying to heat that with, with oil alone uh, was just proven to be disastrous. And I was going through a lot of oil trying to keep my house warm. The typical house will have an R value in its walls of between four and six. Uh, even newer homes may only have about an R9. And what our product allows us to do is completely fill the wall cavity with a foam that's much greater in R value than fiberglass, providing a a wall that's about an R18. There's no doubt, and I don't think anyone can argue, that insulation is one of the best investments you can make in your life. It is the greatest savings to investment ratio. Tri-Polymer has the highest R value per inch of any retrofit insulation product. Tri-Polymer is made in the United States of America. I mean, there's a Made in the USA stamp on top of every barrel. It's manufactured by the CP Chemical Company in White Plains. No one else has the tripolymer formula. So when you call us, you set an appointment, someone will come out to the house, get an understanding of your house and how we can help you, and then the process from there is really simple. We measure the house, the walls, the basement, the roof, the attic, and leave you with a written fixed cost proposal. On the date of your appointment, the crews will arrive working 90% of the day on the outside of the house. The crew then carefully removes a row or two of siding and then cuts the building paper. They then drill behind the building paper, inject the foam, and then plug the holes. They then bib the building paper before installing the siding that's already been removed. Injection foam does not expand when it's in the wall. The foam creeps and crawls and is pushed under pressure around every nook and cranny of that wall cavity. Whether it's an electrical wire, a plumbing pipe, or existing fiberglass, the tripolymer wall foam will fill that wall cavity 100% to its maximum capacity. Whether or not you have fiberglass in the wall doesn't matter. The tripolymer wall foam compresses that fiberglass and replaces it with a much higher, more effective insulation. The typical process from the the date of the appointment when the crew shows up is one to two days, depending on the size of the house. All of our installers are certified tripolymer installers. Every customer is receiving the best possible product. Our crews can, can inject uh, wall cavities that have almost any type of siding, whether it's a brick veneer, a clabbered, a vinyl, a wood shingle, uh, you, you name it. We inject the brick in the mortar joint so as to not damage the individual bricks. It's truly one of the processes that it's hard to tell we were ever there. We really strive to respect customers' personal property and uh, really go, I think, to great length to make sure that the house is left in, in as good a condition or better than we found it. The house feels just more comfortable. It feels tighter. The cabinets, my glasses aren't cold. When I go to make a cup of coffee, I don't have a cold glass to put it in anymore. The crew themselves, they respect your privacy. You're on the inside or come and go and they just take care of your home as if it were their own. And uh, they clean up, they do a great job of cleaning up and you just really don't even know that they were here. I'm beyond satisfied, uh, absolutely elated. And like anything else, the only regret was, and you hear it so often, that you didn't do it sooner, this product wasn't around sooner. Um, I have a friend that just bought an older home and they were describing a similar situation and I told them to get in touch with the folks at Good Life. Your house is going to be a big styrofoam igloo cooler and it's going to keep all the heat in. And running a wood stove and a fireplace and oil heat, I'd be lucky to get the room to 70 degrees, maybe, after a few hours.
Uh, I ran just the wood stove, no oil, no fireplace. And within an hour or so, I had to turn the wood stove down, the blower on it, because the room was 74 degrees. And I just sat there looking at it. This was amazing. After nine years of layering clothes and, and blankets and everything else, the house is finally warm. Everything's just m much more balanced. It's quieter on the inside, and just, you know, whether I'm sitting there reading or watching TV, it just feels home now. It feels like home.